drug case involving the largest number of drugs ever. The drug traffickers apparently had attempted to transport the drugs into Hong Kong, which are supposedly valued at over hundreds of millions of Hong Kong dollars. We are very excited by our latest case involving a record-holding drug seizure. Late at night, traffickers tried to bring the drugs in through Hong Kong Harbor. And an estimate for now... Hey, look at this! You on screen! See something I'm also in the Hey, it ain't that simple. Let's all stay in tonight, shall we? But tomorrow I want to take you out, okay? You know, I hardly see you guys. <laughs> okay, okay. Wow, smells great. Haven't had your home cooking in a while. Is her baby still sick? Just a little bit. Let her rest a while, and I'll make congee for her later. All right. Well, I'm not done yet.
Your father is dead. dead. And so is so 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 your family. family. I am my mother. Your father, father is dead. dead. You're wrong. My mother, my dad is not dead. You have no father. I am my mother. I am my mother. She's got quite the willpower. The machine doesn't seem to be having an effect on her. Take it to nine. I'm afraid if I do that, I will destroy her brain cells. If you don't erase her memory for me, I'll kill you. You're not my mother! My dad is still alive! Your father is dead. Your father is dead. Proud of your track record. You've been receiving many commendations over the years on the force. So now we're sending you off to work with Interpol on an important mission. Thank you, sir. Fifteen years ago, Lung Chi Kung solved a big drug case, one of the largest they'd ever seen. But because of that, his whole family was gunned down in the United States. Hey, sir. That old guy's here. Hmm. Do we really have to talk to him? You know, he's been retired now for 15 years since the injury. I really don't see much point. He probably can't move. I heard he used to be really tough back in the day. And if Madame Rosen killed his family, he'd be our boss. Yeah, but wouldn't he carry most of that hatred with him? Honestly speaking, doubt it. Let's call him. Just call me Lung. Oh, I can't. It's not polite. My father used to work with you. Oh, this is Pete, my partner. Mr. Kung? Your dad's a big shot at Interpol. I don't compare. <laughs> you're highly revered by him. So you're lacking men. Why would you want an old guy like me? For the past year, there have been many unsolved cases. Stealing of information, assassinations, robbing of valuable antiques, all unsolved. And they've been perfectly planned, similar to Madame Rose 15 years ago. Hey, Sammy. The coffee smells great. You're right. Have another one. Don't you touch me. I can tell from your smell that you're someone working for Madame Rose. What kind of sick joke is that, huh? You don't believe me? Are you nuts? She's our coffee lady, Sammy. Hey. Don't go near. Your disguises are getting worse. You're using two colors. Uh, that could be sexual harassment. That coffee will be poisoned. So if we don't drink it, they'll trigger the bomb they got on their chest. Then everybody here dies. Got it. And I don't want to die. What's up? Hey, this is my real skin. It won't come off. You see? You okay? I'm fine. You still got your skills and alertness. But we won't let an enemy come in so easily. Hmm? It's fake. And yeah, she's a cop too. We're testing you. Hey Pete, play the tape. Right. Now before you came to see us today, you had to scan three times. The first scan is your peripheral, confirming you're not armed. The second is your epidermal. That's so we can see whether or not there are any chips under your skin or if you're bugged. The third one... Okay, I got it. We can also analyze your stomach and see what you ate last night. It looks like you had pork chop with spaghetti and some Hyannese chicken and... Honestly, I think that's why you're getting a little big. So what? Did I pass your test? We're glad to have you with us. Good. 
I'm ready to work now. Hey, you two. You finished now? Can you check this out? As I'm sure you're well aware, Mr. Cohn, there are now five incredibly large and influential drug dealers around the world. Iron Wolf from Taiwan, Jimmy from the States, Kato from Japan, Tiger from Thailand, and Honey from the Netherlands. And now they work together. Their alliance has threatened mobsters from all over. The South Americans won't be happy about this news at all. Our intel says that South American dealers hired Madame Rose to deal with them. And we tried really hard to use them to lure Madame Rose out. But it seems like they all just vanished. Tomorrow I have an Interpol meeting in Taiwan. I want you to take charge right here in Hong Kong. Yeah, I'll do it. But I have a request. Tell me. We opened the file about my missing daughter. You still think she's alive? I can feel it. All this time, I have never doubted it. Good. Tonight at night, at Taiyuan Street, Iron Wolf will go to his enemy Ma's funeral. Finish your work, and then return back to your dorm. This is the dress you reserved, isn't it? Okay, thank you.
Today's my birthday. We're gonna celebrate. Wow. <laughs> this isn't bad. I like, I like. Come here, baby. Come here. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. You look tasty. Should I have you? Or the cakey fast? You can have me after you beat me. <laughs> you beat me? Come here! You! Just beat me. And then you can have me, okay? <laughs> Let's do it. Big shot now! You think you're so tough? Just look at where you are now. Of course you're gonna die! Go take in that photo! Yes. <laughs> He's up there! You get out of here! Don't disrespect me. I said that no one is allowed to pay respects to him, and you ignore what I said! You set up a funeral here! I'm his wife! I have to have his funeral! Ignore me! <laughs> take her away! Ignore me!
believe that revenge has been taken for my husband. But please let my children leave this place. They're still so small. We won't talk about you. Just kill me and leave them. When did you get back, huh? Midnight. So then how come at 2.30 you weren't around? I just had some business to take care of. And which guy did you do that for, huh? Drop it. so red. Were you crying? No. I slept so well. Why's that? Because you usually make noises in your sleep that keeps me up. And since you came back so late, it was quiet. I slept great. <laughs> okay, I'm late for class. Mm. I'll see you later. Bye. Yeah, well, my body is, is okay, so I think I'll still go. <laughs> Take care, right? Mm. Hi, Professor. Mm. Hello, Macy. Here, let me introduce you. This is Sam. I'm Macy. Hello. He's from Interpol. He came here for a meeting and wanted to see how I was. He was once one of my best students. <laughs> wow, Interpol. That is so amazing. You're the guys who got the terrorists that blew up the Moscow station. And you were in charge of security at the World Cup in South Africa, right? That's really awesome. <laughs> you seem to know a lot about us. Oh, here. This is my card. Just call me if you want to. All right. Well, I better get to class. Bye. She's quite the young lady, Sam. Whoever gets to marry her will be one lucky guy. Mr. Cohn. It seems the Iron Wolf was killed last night by a female assassin. And apparently she had quite the skills. That's the case with Madame Rose. She trains all her thugs to be like that. Yeah, but this one's different. She didn't kill all. She only killed two guys. And the rest of them are just badly injured. I guess it was her plan. I also found a cloth covered in blood. Maybe it's hers. I'll get a DNA test. 
Her mom's wife won't tell us anything to help us out. The killer got revenge for her husband, Sam, and didn't kill her. Of course she'll be quiet. Ah, uh, also, Jimmy and Kato were also killed last night around the same time. If Rosa's thugs knew she left any evidence, she'd have killed Ma's family. After I settle my kid's stuff, I'll fly over. Hold up, you have a kid? I adopted a child. He's been with me for many years, but now he's grown. Hey kid, throw the ball back. I'm not a kid, I'm skinny. Stand a chance against us. <laughs> no <laughs> way, little guy. Want some of this then? <laughs> what? You kidding? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right on. Picking on me? Because I'm a girl? What? You're not a girl? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Game up then. Okay. Three on three. Who wants to be with her? No, okay. Way, man, not me. I'll play against all of you then. How many times have I told you not to mess around with people? I can protect myself just fine. But can they protect themselves? If they went to hospital, then I'd be in trouble. It's not my fault. They were picking on me first. Hold your ears. And you're not allowed to eat next time. Next time? So I can eat now? Your report card first. Uh, teacher's still grading. Your teacher already called me. Bring it out. Uh, all right. Last time you told me, the card wouldn't come till next term. The next term, you said it was delayed because your principal died. It's almost summertime. If I didn't bring this up, you would have told me they all disappeared because of a fire. You're right. There's a fire at school. Stop lying to me. Uh. Don't you learn what they teach you there? They keep mumbling during class time. I just can't hear what they're saying to me. Fine. I better eat. Or else I think I'll lose my appetite. Okay, Dad. Feet on the floor. Oh. Okay, let's eat. <gasps> You're only going to eat rice today. Let's go out to eat. Okay. Hey, Dad, why don't we have steak tonight? We gotta go to Taiwan later, so you better be good. <laughs> Phoenix, I know you got hurt in Taiwan. I'm just worried. Are you okay? It's nothing big. I'm okay. Did the police come after you? <laughs> there is no need to ask her. You know the answer. Interpol will get you. 
And then there will be trouble as well. It's just a matter of time, isn't it? I just came back from my Japan trip, and I saw this fierce sword. So I bought it for you. Do you like it? <laughs> Blades aren't really my thing. You keep it. The mission's completed, and all of you did very well indeed. I've got the money, one million US for everyone, and I'll deposit the monies into your accounts. Phoenix, you made a terrible mistake. You're soft-hearted. You should have killed that old hag and her kids. I understand, Mum. You should be punished, because your mistake has endangered everyone else. So your money will be shared amongst them instead. Do you agree? Interpol is keeping a close watch on us. So now you have to hide who you are. Thanks a lot. send you here you know I can do this by myself mom sent me to wrap up your case seriously isn't there any other way if snake does it they'll suffer but if I do it they won't feel a thing get out you know I have no choice get out I just want you to know, no matter what happens, I won't let anyone hurt you. Oh, you're back. You're always coming and going. I have to go to Hong Kong soon. Why are the lights off? Trying to scare me? Tonight you'll all face a test. The ten of you have to go through the maze behind you within two hours. After five minutes, a mercenary group will chase after you. Anyone who gets caught by them will face a brutal death. All right, you can go.
Casey. Looking for a professor? I'm on a case right now, and I'm only here for a few days. So I drop by when I have time. What's the case? There was a funeral of a gang leader, and his rival missed it up. But this female killer dropped in and killed him. But then she disappeared. I saw the case on the news. Are there any leads? The professor? He's not feeling well today, so he's just resting at home. He used to take care of me, just like a father. He's been good to me too, but I'm concerned. I just hope he gets well. I gotta get going. See you around. Macy. I know that you're into criminology. So I got you the newest detective novel. There are a lot of cases in here. I think you'll like it. Well, perhaps if you're around, I can take you to dinner as a thank you. Okay, I'll be waiting. Bye. Bye. Hey. Sam? Hey, Pete. What's up? Guess what? The DNA matches Kung's missing daughter. Does Kung know yet? Mr. Kung, busy? Oh, looking for a tutor. The girl's not doing so well. She'll be held back if I don't get some help. I could help her out. <laughs> Thanks. So what do you want? Oh, the DNA test of the killer at the funeral? We found only one match. And guess what, big guy? It's the same as your daughter that went missing 15 years ago. Give me a ticket for Taiwan. Mr. Wong figured that out, so he's already got you a ticket. You made it. This is mine, a child in the house. It's safe. How's your child? She was shocked that day. She has a fever now. This reminds me of 15 years ago. The killer took away my daughter on that night. And she had a fever too. Fifteen years ago, I worked in a case for Interpol. We were aiming to get rid of the drug dealers. Madame Rose struck a deal in smuggling large amounts of heroin, trying to get it across the border and into China. I intercepted the drugs, successfully. After a month, I went to the States, but Madame Rose followed me there, to my wife's family. She killed my wife. And her entire family. But I stayed alive. And they took her away, my little 10-year-old baby. For 15 years, I've been looking for her. Never stop. Happy birthday, wherever you are. And then they told me that the DNA of the killer is the same as my little girl. You still have your child, so you know what I'm feeling. And I know the gratitude that you feel, and you won't ever betray that killer. That is only natural. All I ever wanted was just to see my daughter again. Only you can help me. My family would really appreciate it, too.
It's way too hard. There are too many people. It's gonna take a lot of time. A lot of time? What are you doing here? Keep on searching. Come on, go! Yeah? Peter. Yep. Got a map for the picture yet? Oh, we've been using the computer and looking for over 24 hours. But do you know how many Chinese girls around that age look like that picture all over the world? Just hurry up. Better be done before I get back. Ah, uh, sir, we'll be here a while. We got 30 million. 30 million? Oh my god. Mother, we've got a clip here from Taiwan. Dong Chi Kung, you're still alive, are you? But you won't be for much longer. Mom, let me go. Not you. I have someone else for this. Oh, madam, I think this will suit you. Okay, thank you. Oh, hi, pretty. Do you think this one fits me well? <laughs> yeah, I think it does, <laughs> sister. My name's Honey. And you? Oh, my name's Ivy. Oh. Honey, aren't you? <laughs> I'm one of Jimmy's buddies. <gasps> Tell me, have you progressed in your search yet? Well, we're getting there. Sam's been looking at it all day. Before? He fancies the girl in the picture. That picture is of my daughter. Hey, you know what I'm thinking, sir? That you'll end up being Sam's father-in-law. It also means that I'd be your dad. <laughs> Daddy. I'm being serious. Honestly, look at how he's staring at her picture. I know it's her. You think he's already met my daughter? Who on earth knows? Go ask him. Uh, there's no point. He's got the reputation of keeping things inside. He won't tell a squat. I think I'll go home then. Mm. You know my other one. She'll get into trouble if I'm not around. Call me with any news. Oh, Mr. Kung, when shall I start tutoring your daughter? I've got someone. Get someone? Who else could be better than me? Hello, I'm back. Hey, Dad. My tutor's here with me. Oh, good. Don't bother with me. I'll cook dinner. Just concentrate. Huh? What are you going to make us? Your favorite, chicken thighs. See? Huh? Chicken thighs? Yeah. So you think he's fat? He's not that overweight. It's endearing. Oh, don't say that stuff to me. Even though he loves to eat his food, he really is amazing with his awesome martial arts. Really? Yeah, he taught me everything I know. Skinny, is your tutor staying for dinner? No, I can't. I really shouldn't. You guys <sighs> Please don't worry about it. No, Just really. stay for dinner, okay? I ate already. I'm fine. Hey, Dad! She'll eat as well. Good. Here, try my cooking.
you know, once you've tried out my dad's cooking, you'll always want to eat here. She's my daughter, isn't she? And if she isn't, I'll be dead if she takes action first. And if I think she isn't, kill her and find out she is, I'll still die. What do I do? Teacher, maybe you could charge me less, and I'll ask my dad to let you have dinner here with us. You know, it gets really lonely eating here sometimes. We'd be happy to have you. Help me, Buddha. Sorry, do you mind if we watch TV while we eat? Uh, no. Some people like watching the daily news. I like watching my stuff. sister? Great, you came back. I was about to call you. We just found the photo of the killer. Wow, you've got the same expression on your face as when I showed it to Sam. Mr. Kong, I was looking for you. What did you already know? Uh, just calm down. <laughs> calm down. Mr. Kong? Please, calm down. When did you see my daughter? What did you hide from me? Be calm. I'm gonna girl back in Taiwan at the university. She looked like her. Why didn't you say anything? I really wanted to, but I just couldn't. Why not? I, I like her. And I was afraid if she wasn't the killer, we'd harm her. Look, I don't give a damn about the mission. I just want her back with me. She came over, disguised as a tutor. I think she was planning on killing me. But then, she saw a tape of her birthday 15 years ago. It reminded her of something. And then she left. She went to your home? That means she didn't know we suspect her. What are you saying? She went back to Taiwan? Because that's where she hides out? Why'd you come back? I 
really have no idea. I guess he came back to think. You've been exposed. Mother won't let this slide. You know her well. You know what she's capable of. And I don't know how many people she's sent to kill you. And when she wants to kill someone, no one can escape. Also, Ivy was killed. I know the job went to Tiger and that honey. We need to go. Hey, where are you going? I have something for you. Come on! Come back. Now this is terrible. Madame Rose won't stop till she's dead. If she ran away, how are we supposed to lure her out again? Just get a loved one to be threatened. Exactly. So I want you to be the bait. And when she shows up, maybe we'll find Madame Rose's base. That's insane. How are we supposed to do this? Do I go out and yell, come out, Sam, help? Will that work? Mm -mm. We just put a small chip inside of you, and then we'll track you. And put the chip where? Oh, a place that even you cannot see. Not down there. Of course not. On your neck. You better put me to sleep, because I hate needles. What was that? Did it hurt? A little. Oh. When do I get it? I already did it with this little guy right here. Huh? Well, that was fast. Technology's so advanced. Yeah? Hello, I'm Lynn Whitey's teacher. She hurt three students in a fight, and they want to report it. 
Was it serious? You better come here right now. Yeah, okay. Something wrong? Um, my daughter hurt three students. They got into a fight. And I gotta go to a school now, where they'll report it. So I better get going. Straighten all this mess out. Come get me, come get me. No one's been after me all day. I don't know what the plan is. I'm back now. Are you trying to be good? I told you not to fight. I always tell you. Do you listen? All right, the school's gonna report this. Get ready for jail. What's wrong with you? The fight turned you into a dummy? Yes, sir! Huh? Hmm. plastic surgery. You look like your dead mother. Yeah. Hey Sam, it seems like Kung's GPS is being interfered with. That means they took the bait. Rose used Kong to get Macy back. Go follow them. Then you should find her base. Go as fast as you can. Got it. Don't look back. I have some questions for you. You answer truthfully or I'll shoot you. Unless it's confidential, I'll answer. Whatever you want. Is Lung Chi Kung my father? The results of the DNA says that you're his girl who went missing long ago. Impossible. Remember what happened 15 years ago? Madam Rose had you brainwashed. You can't let Lung Chi Kung go after Madam Rose. He won't survive. Macy, please just help us with the case. Do what is right here. Help us get Madam Rose, or reduce your sentence. Rose wants to kill you. Iron Wolf's people want to kill you as well. You can't deal with them alone. Why do you even care so much? Because I like you. Don't follow me. Waiting for your daughter, and then a happy reunion? Watch for the thunder. When we leave this place. I'll starve you for days. Then we'll see how funny you are. Hey, Dad, I'm scared. I'm scared as well. But you gotta know this. Being scared is a waste. Once you know that, you're fine. You okay with starving, though? You just look at me. I'm full of reserve. I'll be fine. But I have no reserves. 
Look awful delivery. Burgers, pizzas. Dad says they'll come wherever we are. You're stupid. Don't you call me stupid. Stupid. We've cracked the interference for the GPS. Lung Chi Kung is on an island over towards the south side. The sniper team is ready. Let's go. Yes, sir! What are you doing? I'm just trying your seat. Oh, really? Hm. You're not qualified, dear. Oh, am I not? Get off! <laughs> Children! Oh, nobody will answer you. I made sure of that. You haven't seen Brother Pow in a while, have you? Honey... Hey, Madam Rose! Hey! Madam Rose! I'm here to destroy you! Did you dare betray me? Betray you? What a thing to say. Weren't you the one that betrayed us? Killed all our parents and took us away? And then... Weren't you the one that killed your own mother for the throne where I sit now? Let's see... You're not in shape. She shot your leg, right? So now your worthless cripple. Hey, cousin! Ah... Uh, you've got no skills in lying. Do you think you'd have such a figure after having so many babies throughout these years, huh? Are you queen of the ants? Okay! Honey... <laughs> tiger... Action! Mom, watch out! <laughs> <laughs> Think I didn't know your sticks again? I stole it and took out all those bad bullets. <laughs> <laughs> of the most dreadful killers ever. It's just nothing to be feared about at all. How dare you go around telling everyone all over the world how terrifying your beautiful young daughters are. Just look at Ivy, so vulnerable. Ah, but Selina here is smart, see? She looked at me, follows me now, and works for me. I just do it for the money. So find the one who pays. So you're telling me you killed my men so that you could get some dosh. Everyone will fear me. Once I destroy you, Selena, fix her up. Hi, Mom. So you quit?
Isn't Sam here too? On his way, but Selena's teamed up with Power against Madame Rose. They have a lot of guys out there waiting for us. Hey, Dad. He's this. I'm okay. You keep it. Your father's fine. There's a shortcut this way. Go, go, go! Go, go, go! What a power. She killed Iron Wolf. Ah, I've been complaining for not having enough fun at this place. I guess we got what we asked for now. Ah! <sighs> It's just you. And her father. Yeah, her sister too! Give you 500 to kill them. Together, we're unstoppable. Daughter, dad, fist. Hey, dad, that sounds stupid. So you'd say? Kick ass kung fu. I'll kick you to hell. Yeah. <laughs> Let me get 
Does that feel good? Daughter, Dad, Fist. Mon, didn't we already talk about that? Daughter, Dad, Fist. Kick ass kung fu. <laughs> Mr. Kung, we made it. You're already late. Why'd you bother? Hey, where's your daughter?
You're too selfish! And you're so centered! I know I like dragons! But you took him away from me! And he even died for you! I didn't take him from you! possibly know what love is. We've never had a chance to see the real world, but you feel the dragon is not love. Yeah, he was like my brother. Someone once told me they liked me, but I didn't know how to react to those words. Because I don't know what that's supposed to feel like. But I'm starting to understand. Most of my life was controlled by our mother. I don't want to live the rest of my life in jail. Search the area. Yes, sir! Missy, I'm glad you're okay. Call right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, it's Sam. The three of us were victorious. Four, actually. Him? He's not in the family. We should go. I will ask the judge to reduce your sentence. No matter what, I will wait for you. Thank you. 